So hello everyone, my name is Harsh and with me we have Vijay. Vijay is the one who is mainly responsible for putting free CAD tutorials on our channel. So in this video, I wanted to learn some free CAD from him and he will be starting it from the very beginning. Like I don't know anything about free CAD, so I just wanted to start it myself also. So I asked him to explain it to me. And in the meanwhile, we started off thinking recording it so that maybe someone else who is interested in learning free CAD also from the start can learn with us. So Vijay, over to you. So uh, I have some questions before we start, like uh, I know SolidWorks, I know Inventor, a bit of Fusion also because Fusion also is done by you most of the times. So what I wanted to understand, like in most of the 3D softwares, we see uh, the very first command which we all learn or which we all do is the extrude and it's like same in inventor also we so what is the there in free pad in free CAD. It's pad okay so you, you you call it pad so can you illustrate one like how to start like where are the sketch planes in this or is there any alternative so how yes. do you like if you just need to uh, need to uh, draw a simple cuboid how will how should i start like a 100 by 100 by 100 cube yeah sure i will explain to you mm -hmm. first let's go to part design okay and we need to create the sketch first this is the command create sketch now we need to select the plane like xy plane choose here Now, we need, if we want to create a cube, we will have to use a rectangle command. I choose center okay. rectangle command. Uh, from here, we can give the dimensions. For vertical distance, mm -hmm. we will give 100. 100 mm. Mm -hmm. And for horizontal direction, we give same 100 mm. Now the uh, sketch is created, we will close it and use the pad command here, we will give 100. Now do OK. This is how we create cube in this in FreeCAD. Okay, so it's a, it's a part file, right? It's not an assembly file or do we have yeah. separate files for both of them or it's just a one file in which we do all it actually we have two method for this we can do okay. assembly in part also and as we have separate command for assembly uh, for assembly we call so, it 82 plus okay so let's not jump to assembly first i just wanted to understand in the beginning we have different templates in uh, solidworks like when we choose when we start a new file and we simply select the file we need to create like if it's an assembly file then we click on assembly and if it's a part file then we click on part file right so that like that we don't do in this we simply open a new file can you simply start like when we open it we have to create absolutely new design can you click on new file then what does it show yeah sure does i can it... hmm. here's the command for new new file. so it simply creates it it doesn't ask anything whether it's a part assembly or anything else it simply creates a new <laughs> file Yes, yeah, sir. Actually, right. we have different add-ons for this, for assembly and part design. This is the part design, and for uh, we use A2 Plus for assembly. Okay. So, okay. Uh, can you come back to the uh, the uh, the previous part which we just did? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. This so in this file, so in this file, this is an this is a this is a cube. This is a part file till now. But now you have changed that. So it has become an assembly now. I mean, no. can we change it oftenly or is it like we ch you have to select once it's selected, we can't change it? Yeah, we can change it. We can change it. Okay, so like it maybe it is, if I'm not wrong, is it similar to what we have in Fusion? Uh, what command, sir? 
like this thing assembly and part i if i am not wrong i think we have both of them in the same file yeah we can do that in the same file also and uh, we can do separately also okay okay i think that may be too much for me in the beginning so let's 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 do the other command uh, let's let's do revolve revolve okay how, how, how do you do it okay i will tell you or maybe a cut text rule let's do some cut text rule in this cut text rule first we need to go to part design mm -hmm. and for extrude cut also we have to draw some sketch for this we will select this plane mm -hmm. and create sketch mm -hmm. we will create a circle for here here center circle we will give the diameter as let's give a 75 25 mm now we will close this sketch and extrude cut here is the extrude command we call it pocket yes, extrude cut or it's ex yeah. actually we call it pocket for this okay and we will give 10 mm here now click okay this is how we do extrude in free cut so what do they call it pocket we call it pocket for extrude cut and we call it pad for uh, for extrude boss okay okay makes sense so all right so uh, and when we save it what is the file extension it creates uh, yeah i will show it first we will have to go to file and then choose the save command here we see the file extension it's f C S T D. All right, all right. Yeah. So the file extension is same for assembly and part, right? It is same. Yeah, I'll check and tell you. Okay. No problem. I know we all are not very. Yeah, it's same. It's, it's same. Dot S C S S T D. Okay. Ah. Okay. So. anything else i think know? that's 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 enough for now we shouldn't make it too long enough maybe i really want to try, try till here and then maybe we have another session going ahead for the next thing okay for the next part so let me complete till here and we will keep sharing this on our channel also so that other people who want to learn free cad from the beginning they can also learn yeah yeah that's thank good thank you very thank you very much for your time vijay And thank yeah, you viewers for watching it here so uh, i would like to say in this case like if anyone from our viewer also would like want to join us in this kind of screen share teaching maybe 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 we can plan something like that so if anyone is interested to join us in this call uh, they can simply drop us a message or leave a comment we will contact them okay vijay thank you for your time I okay you are welcome that helped that helped a lot thank you okay thank you